Hello there. I just wanted to show you this rig I put together to help me understand and learn about the Arduino chip kit and using each of them to control a large stepper motor. This first video shows a stepper motor being controlled by an Arduino Uno and the second video will be controlling the same motor but this time with a chip kit Uno 32 board. Firstly, I'll talk you through the components. The stepper motor I'm using is a NEMA 34 bipolar 4 wire 200 full steps per revolution 1.8 degrees per step. Driving the motor I have a micro step driver type DQ860MA and I've set the driver up via its dip switches to drive the motor at 800 pulses per rev. 800 pulses divided into 360 degrees means each pulse moves the motor 0 0.45 degrees. This particular microstep driver can handle a power supply of up to 80 volts DC maximum. One of the advantages of using a microstrip driver with an Arduino or a chip, chip kit board is that the signal inputs are normally opto-isolated, i.e. there is no current flow between the devices. So you don't have to worry about how much sourcing or syncing the Arduino or chip kit can handle. The good news is they operate in isolation no matter what size the stepper motor. So the likelihood of damage between your Arduino and the stepper motor interface is engineered out. The power supply is rated at 230 volts AC in at 4 amps and 60 volts DC out at 5.85 amps. So that's 60 volts DC supplied to the stepper motor and the driver. And as you're probably aware, the higher the voltage, the greater the torque from the motor. The next item is a small linear carriage which is driven up and down with a lead screw to which I've attached a spider drive coupling between screw and motor. Fixed to the carriage you will see I've formed and attached a U-shaped bracket which will act as my reference flag. To the right of the linear carriage you will see I have mounted a photo interrupter. This will be my homing sensor. The reason I went for this type of photo interrupter module is that, well, one, it's cheap to buy, two, it's accurate and has a voltage comparator chip on the PCB which gives a nice clean 5 volt TTL output which the Arduino can read and three with a 5 volt supply my meter tells me it's only drawing 5 milliamps which is well below the 40 milliamp Arduino sinking or sourcing threshold. Finally the Arduino Uno. I produced a sketch that uses the Excel stepper library and I wanted to see how fast and accurate the Arduino could run my stepper and uh, reading the Axel stepper notes I see that the maximum reliable stepping speed using uh, Excel stepper with a 16 megahertz Arduino is 4000 pulses a second so that's what I've specified in my max speed parameter within my sketch So, this is what should happen when I power up the Arduino. Firstly on power up, because I don't know where the carriage position is, I'm going to slowly drive the motor in one direction until the carriage flag triggers the photo interrupter. That I will now call the zero reference position within my program. And from then on the carriage will accelerate up and down in a continuous loop 
with the motor reaching a maximum speed of 4,000 pulses per second. Thank <laughs> you. 